Sierra is the name of the system that Livermore is getting out of the Coral Partnership. Coral stands for collaboration between Oak Ridge, Argonne, and Lawrence Livermore. And it's a partnership with the other laboratories in the Department of Energy such that we can together get more buying power and have more influence over vendors. And so by pooling our money together, going out to bid together, and choosing a common solution, we're able to negotiate a better deal and get computers that we can deploy in multiple places that have similar technology. Sierra is what we call a, an advanced technology platform. It's a very large system and uh, is, will, will be sited here at Livermore and will serve um, the three NNSA laboratories in California and New Mexico. So ATS2, which is the Sierra system, is the second in a series of four systems that are on a roadmap to get us to exascale computing in 2024. Uh, you can see it's kind of a complicated big job. At the end, we should have about 260 racks of the computer. This will be the biggest computer we installed at Livermore, not only in size and number of racks, but also in speed. We need Sierra because our codes need to be more predictive than they were you know, 20 years ago, 30 years ago, when we were doing nuclear testing. Well, the benefit to the codes really is just being able to uh, run problems faster and run bigger, more complex problems. So ultimately, these codes are used in support of the stockpile stewardship mission here. It's 125 peta operations per second. So to sort of break that down, that's a, almost equivalent of having like 100 million uh, PCs working on a single problem at one time. The Sierra system is uh, called advanced technology because it's heterogeneous and employs um, NVIDIA uh, high performance GP GPUs along with very powerful uh, Power9 processors from IBM and it will scale to 125 petaflops. This will be the first uh, truly heterogeneous production capability system for NNSA. Well, GPUs are a fairly well-known technology at this point. How our applications would make use of them has, has been the um, overriding concern that we've had. So we've been actively working with our application teams to deploy smaller systems with GPUs that they could work on and also to work closely with IBM and NVIDIA to prepare those applications for the GPUs. We're preparing for Sierra uh, the same way we prepare our applications for a lot of the major challenges we have. We have a very team-oriented approach, so our application teams are made up of code physicists, computer scientists, engineers, chemists, all working together uh, on these singular challenges. Getting onto this next uh, system, Sierra, is one of those challenges, and we've really tried to have everybody uh, working together on this for several years now. Going, It's been about three years since we've known this is the platform we were going to be deploying. One can't really buy this kind of computer and just expect it to be delivered. So it's really, it's really been a very interesting and complex project and Livermore has a good history with partnering with our vendors. In this case we're partnering with IBM and uh, NVIDIA and Mellanox to deliver this computer. We couldn't have done it without us all together and it takes years to develop this and to work on the the different components of the computer and to get something like, like what we're going to get delivered. And it's absolutely invaluable to have something, the vendors involved in this, because we want them to be successful, we want us to be successful, and it helps their business by uh, working with us to accelerate some of their technology.